can move all of these guys down here. We should probably leave someone back. I don't want to leave Jeff back. <laughs> Not Jeff. No, I can't leave Jeff back. We'll leave Steve McClung. We'll leave him back. And then Mr. Shorge may come over here too. He actually has Pikemen right now, but he doesn't have Musketmen, so that's good. Uh, I can probably move you forward too. Because I'm not really worried about hitting my capital or hitting my city. Uh, we want to keep getting university, keep getting that science going. Uh, and then we are going to start working on making our city better. So what are we currently doing right now? We could use a couple farms here, get more food. That's going to grow quicker. Uh, a couple lumber mills might not be bad. Uh, is there, we could put a mine over here. Actually, let's start with the mine for the production and then go from there. I wouldn't know. I don't watch, uh, Filthy and I watch you and besides I've never played Civ. Oh. Yeah, I've only played Civ multiplayer on our live streams. Um, we should do another multiplayer one. I think I talked about doing that on Saturday's streams was actually make that a multiplayer one, but I haven't done that quite yet. Cool, taken care of. Give me the horse. Uh, and then I think we want incense and tea. Only so we can sell them off and we get the extra amenities. Because we're suffering amenities really bad right now. Too many wars. Oh, I can't even move you away. All right, well, you're going to stay there. Thank you. Actually, you know what? Between my two galleys and a swordsman, I might be able to take ruin with no problem. You still need your revenge. <laughs> uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Smooth. That was all in your head. Nothing bad happened. <laughs> I definitely didn't, like, sneak attack you. No. No, that was... That never happened. I should move some of these units this way. Come over here, please. And Jeff. Come on. I need you, buddy. And you come over here. Something like that. When are we going to declare war? Now? I kind of feel like we should just declare it at this point. I can start pillaging. Oh, hi. Massive religion war going underway. Yeah, let's do it. Can I bring someone else in? Oh, hey, hold up. Yo, friends. I'm happy. Let's be friends. Uh, hey, can we get a military alliance? Yes. Gold per turn? Yes. No. What about an elephant? Would you give me an elephant for this? No. Would you give me your niter? <laughs> tried. I tried. What if I give you... No, you have so many iron, you don't want it. I'll give you a dish. You give me that. And you want... You're not willing to trade that. But you don't have this. Sure, whatever. Oh, wait. Actually, hold up. I want a joint war... With Catherine. You want me to pay you seven gold and three gold. We're only making eight gold per turn. Yeah, because we're no longer in that war. I remember paying Civ 1 when it first came out. I'd never played Civ 1 or 2. I think 3 I played. 4 was my thing. 5 was also my thing. Uh, after Earth was not really my thing and then here we are on six so and you watch a lot of civ six wow seven series dang i saw quill was starting a new one i like quill quill's fun quill is like if someday i could be one youtuber it'd be quill i think he's like me where he's very analytical um and i think he's very chill like me too you know uh what were we doing oh yeah we were trying to uh pull him into this war if we didn't pull him into this war, could we get Montezuma into this war? Hi. So we have to actually be friendly to get a joint war now? Was that always a thing? I don't remember that always being a thing. Dang. I mean, we don't really need his help, though. So in that case, then, I don't think I necessarily would want the alliance. I mean, the alliance would be good if someone declared war on me. You know what? Screw it. Uh, Civ 5 or Civ 6? <sighs> That's a tough one. 
and I'm actually going to steal Quill's definition now that we're talking about him on this. I think both are good for different reasons. We were playing Civ 5 on a live stream a couple weeks ago, and I just remember like Venice and we're like, we're looking at like uh, By Byzantium and all these other Civs, and I'm like, man, I miss these Civs. And I really, really like Civ 5. Um, but I do really love what they did with Civ 6 with the districts. I think that's so great. Um, I wish though Civ 5 had or Civ 6 had some of the stuff like that Civ 5 had um, Civ 5 just still feels far more fleshed out like the diplomacy game and all that stuff um, So yeah, uh, I watch you play you want to watch me play herbal uh, Kerbal space program the funny thing is I actually got that one for free on um, a Humble monthly and I immediately deleted it because that's when the whole thing about it having spyware came out and then like I also tried playing it so complex so um, that's why I just never really got into it. All right, enough talking. France, you die. Uh, Casabella. Eh, whatever. Actually, you know what? No, no. He's the only guy that loves me. He's the only guy that loves me. I need him to not have... I need him to not have, uh, the negatives. What if I give you this? Does that change the price at all? Only two gold now. Okay. It's still the same. All right, I'll pay you two gold. Let's do this. So now he's going to get the warmongering penalty as well. Hey, what's up? Honored to meet you. Um, I just declared war on this guy. So yeah, 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 yeah. Rip France. I just wanted to blow stuff up. The th problem with Kerbal is it's so complex. And like, I played it for what? 20 well probably yeah only like 20 30 minutes and i was just so overwhelmed and i'm like this was gonna take me days to figure out so i'm gonna move you over here i'm gonna move you down there the problem is our knight's now way out of position so that's fine we'll put you there i want to come grab this guy and we're gonna fortify can i run you back i actually can run you back so i'm just gonna run you back and then let's fortify you up here my goal is for them to hopefully come attack me. They're already fortified. So yeah, I kind of want them to attack me. Ordolo is going to shoot our dude here, which is kind of disappointing, but that's okay. Uh, let's get you here. Diplomacy is the weakest part. Oh, I agree. Especially now that, I mean, they finally added in joint wars, which is nice, but you can see like the whole bugged about, hey, you're going to pay me 300 golds for this joint war, which may or may not be bugged. I'm not admitting to that. Um, yeah, it's just, it's weird. And then, like, oh, my favorite thing was the UN back in the day and getting, like, a UN victory. Like, oh, I love that stuff. So, uh, I'm not going to send you to Watertown. I think I'm going to send you, I'm going to send you foreign. We need to start getting some more gold. We can get one science here with eight gold. Or we can get one extra production. And one production here, too. You're not our allies, so let's send you over here to Spain. You like to figure stuff out? Yeah, I mean... That's one of the things I love about uh, YouTube and I love doing things online is because you guys can like help me out, uh, especially uh, on series that I may or may like if I just start a series, I might not know what I'm doing. And then you guys can throw some tips my way and really help out. And actually, that just recently happened, too, with our we want to mine here uh, with our Egypt series. Uh, I actually had someone send me a bunch of comments and I'm like, that is so freaking helpful. I wasn't 100 percent sure what was happening here, though. So. You discovered a uh, sieve through four star playing it. Team four star? I hadn't heard of them. I feel like city improvements should be scaled down a bit. Like you're talking about uh, this guy starting World War Three. <laughs> uh, are you talking about like the graphics are too large? I actually don't mind the graphics. I remember when it first got announced, everyone was hating on it, like looking too cartoony. I really don't mind it. Oh, hi. We found France's army. Okay. You have great respect for people who declare friends. Well, I'm glad, because we friended you. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get a little bit of that warmongering. I can't really stop that, so. There are very honest What's up, people DC Coke? who do not think that they have had a bargain unless they have cheated a merchant. I love your AI only but you. Thanks, Tyrese. Sweet. Now we got the meme spam. Hell yeah. Just wait a bit so France can start her. Oh yeah, I'm not really worried about losing to France at this point, but it, you know, you know, 
Especially since they're gonna come here and attack me, and I'm in a fairly defensive position. The only downside we kind of have right now is all our archers and crossbowmen are pretty far away. Um, I think I will do one. No, you know what? Let's move you here. And I'll fortify you up, and I'll put you here and fortify you here. Actually, I should have moved him here because he was already getting fortified, but whatever. Um, I'm going to move you down here, and we're going to use you to push this direction. You guys, like I said, are just fortifying up. I don't think the city can hit me quick enough. Let's run you back. Yeah, I have too many... That was not what I did. That was not at all what I did. Uh, we're going to work on Cali first, and then we're going to go from there. Let's get you coming over here. How am I gonna shoot Cali? I need two archers here, and then we're gonna want our melee units up here as well. So I'm gonna put you here, and then you're gonna come here. And then I need you desperately over here. And I'm probably gonna put you here. Now nah, let's leave you here for the time being, so. Rainbow nukes. No, I understand what you're talking about, Smooth. Yeah, France always surrenders. Yeah, no, I, I, I got you on that. Um, what kind of tech, or what civs do we want to do right here? We could do monarchy. So we can get a little more. I probably should have grabbed monarchy a while ago, but that's okay. You should get in game editor when doing AI only. How do I do that? I don't think I've ever heard about the AI in game editor. Move you here, and then I'll come grab you down here. And let's get you in the city, and then we're going to heal you. Okay, let's see what France is going to bring to the table here. Um, man, I really need more science, but I can't get freaking science up here. Ugh. So, I guess let's do Theater Square so we don't fall too far behind on this. Hmm, what's going to be the best way to do this? We could do a harbor here. We have to, our city's too good right now. I think we're just going to put it here. Or you can make your own maps. See, I've always been kind of worried about that because I always thought like it was too much, uh, like you need programming skills and stuff like that. So I've always kind of just avoided that. And he's doing a great TSL. You should check out the mods, some of the mods. Uh, I will copy his name and I will look at him. The funny thing is I'm also currently looking for YouTubers to, um, uh, I think he spelled his name wrong. Because I typed into Google and I didn't get anything. But I'm trying to find some YouTubers to play with. That sounds really bad. Um, to play the game with, so. Where did we put him? Ping, where'd you go? Oh, crap. Because we have the freaking negatives here. We're not building anything. <laughs> Whoopsie. And we're still losing loyalty. <gasps> we're going to lose our town. What? Uh, Whoopsie. Did I screw up because I moved a unit out of here? I think I need to move one of my units back. Starvation. You're starving? What? Oh, I didn't realize that. Hi. How are you starving so bad? Crap. All right. Whoopsie, we screwed this up all the way. All right, I'm um, typing in one more time. Okay, I think I found him. The Eurycenes one? Yeah, Civ 6 Mapuche. Okay, I'll check him out. Hey, y'all, this is... Ah, hi. <laughs> he takes a long time to win the game. I tried. I tried collabing with uh, Whiskey. The problem is, since he's in Europe, he was a little concerned about um, uh, uh, just, like, finding the right time. So we talked a little bit about it, and then it just kind of fell through. So, uh, ironically, this was going to be the kind of game I was going to play with him. I wanted to do this actual kind of playthrough, this Battle for America. Like, maybe he'd be, like, Aztecs, and I'd be America or something like that, or vice versa. Or actually, he could have been one of the foreign cities. That would have been great, too, or foreign powers. I said he just... Ooh, no, we want... I think we're going Madrid. I want money. I want money. So, I'm a big Rome fan. Love yours. Nice, nice, nice. Let me edit the maps so you can hide sub where the AI can't find you. Oh, that would be interesting. Okay. He's a little too slow for you. Okay, he's got a really great people mod and mod still is aged down for more realistic time. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll check that out for sure. One of the reasons I talked about this earlier, I was thinking about doing a Civ, uh, or rather a Stellaris Let's Play. Or sorry, AI only with Stellaris was because um, I saw that no one else was doing it. 
<laughs> so I was like, hey, we could be like the first one to do a Stellaris AI. And actually, I'm sure there are some, but what I was looking at is I was looking at like daily videos. Not a lot of people are doing Stellaris right now again, so. Yeah, Smooth has given me a bunch of mods. I've been very slow on doing mods recently because every time I do mods, the game freaking bugs out on me. Yeah, 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 I'm a warmonger. Everyone knows that. Do we lose a unit? Don't shoot my ship. Oh! Oh! Aztec was friendly and now we're at war with Aztec. I did not realize that. Oh, well. Whoopsie. Crap, he's gonna come blow up my ship. So let's run away. AI hey, only EU4 is good. Yeah, that's what people have said. Yeah, and here's the thing, like, you can watch, like, I've seen it with my own videos, you know, anytime a series gets to, like, 10 episodes, I say there's a massive drop-off in viewership, and it's not end-all, be-all, but it really does kind of affect things, and so, like, you know, my Battletech series, I finished, even though it was, like, you know, 10,000 episodes, just because, um, you know, I really wanted to, um, finish the game, and we put so much time into it, I really, really wanted to do it. Um, but then, you know, the downside is obviously by the end, very few people were actually watching it. So, uh, can scale or no combat from attacking C. Let's do combat while attacking C. We're going to go ahead and let's move you back. We're still losing Watertown. I need freaking builders, man. I need some food. Get down here. We're going to lose the city before then. Get down here. Are you going to kill me? You will. So we should probably run back. Let's get a little bit of healing go. We could have moved him back and uh, leveled him up, but that's okay. Get you coming down here. Let's get you coming down here. Ugh, you guys are chatting so much. And I'm, like, trying to focus on the game, so it's like... I'm trying to do a little bolt, and my brain's starting to get, like, a little, like, wonky because it's getting late. Not really late, but, you know. I'm getting tired, I guess, is the point. Uh, I'm going to move you up here. I think we're okay to actually start moving here in on Cali. Put enough units here. We'll be okay. Yeah, let's try something like this. No more archers here. So, join the Twitch Master Race. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, is YouTube lagging again? I don't know. And da, da, da. You should try that overhaul mod. You really did start World War III. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, Tyrese. What you're asking me to do, send me a... um, Put a comment in, like, one of my videos or something saying, hey, do this. Uh, only because uh, that's going to be easier for me to look at later and be like, oh, yeah, okay, let me do that. Because, um, like, right now, I mean, I could write it down, but I'm not 100% sure what you're trying to do or what you're telling me. So, if I type it down, it, my notes, I'm not going to understand them. So are you going to play a little CK2? Probably not because, okay, so here's the thing with, like, EU4. I was looking at it today, and I have the first six expansions for EU4. I'm missing the last six expansions. So that's like $20 each. That's $120 worth of, right? Wait, 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 six, 12. Yeah, that's $120 worth of content I don't have. CQ, CK2 is even worse than that. So probably not. So, dude, 10.8's in the Caribbean. That's awesome, dude. The problem with that, um, we could pillage for gold. You know what, screw you. I'm gonna pillage you for gold. I'm gonna put you up here. And we're just going to get some distractions, so. Yeah, I'm, and I know, but, like, a lot of people like to see all the DLC. And, you know, I just don't want to start something, especially... And here's the other issue. I'm way far behind. EU4, I have a couple hundred hours in. But I have not played the game in le legit over a year. So, I'm just feeling like I'm just not going to be as good. And I don't want to, like... I've mentioned this before. I just don't want to play a game that I'm not particularly good at, so. CK2 is Crusader Kings 2. Uh, it's the predecessor to EU4. Well, technically, it's the sequel to EU3. <laughs> predecessor to EU4. I want to see you get mad at kids. You raced horribly. You seem like you rage funny. Here's the thing, uh, and I've talked about this in my... Uh... Sure. Sure. Three old... Yeah, they'll make them like me a little better. Um, I talked about this when we were live streaming Rocket League a lot last week. Blast I'm super build. competitive. Like, I am hyper, hyper competitive. So, the problem is, if I play any online multiplayer game, like, I love, 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 love 
uh, a siege, I am so freaking competitive in it, I get very salty. And the thing is, I hate it about myself, but I just start complaining about everything, and, you know, online especially when you're super salty, everyone's just like, oh, you're so salty, and, you know, I, probably, yeah, you can find it funny, but a lot of people just hate on me for it, so that's where I try to just avoid it. Alright, we are gonna move in. We're getting ready here. What if we pillage, we get gold? Okay, dang it. Let's just heal up for the time being. Um, I'm gonna move you here, because I don't think I can move and shoot. Yeah... But then we can shoot next turn. I just don't want him to shoot me, so. I only have 123 hours. All right, there you go. Victoria 2 is after EU4. Well, there you go. Okay, EU4 is uh, Europa Universalis 4. Uh, think of this game just like 100 times more math and more complex. So. Uh, then Crusader Kings 2 is the same thing at that. <laughs> I've only played Fortnite for about three minutes, so. Here's the funny thing. I'm actually highly debating uh, about playing... Um, oh my gosh, No Man's Sky. So, No Man's Sky, and I never, ever, ever, ever thought I would say this, but No Man's Sky is coming out with an update next week that adds multiplayer, and I'm trying to get my friend James to join me and play uh, it, and I'm really shocked that I might actually play No Man's Sky because of how bad it was, but yeah, yeah. This is true. You do seek it, but... I also don't want to be known as the salty YouTuber, <laughs> so. And the thing is, you see my salt in Civ. Uh, I mean, it has been very evident numerous times, my salt, so. All right, you got really hurt, so we should probably run you back. Oh, he didn't actually build that. Oh, you know, I could have. Oh, wait, that's a farm. Crap, I don't have enough HP. Uh, let's just put you all the way back then. And then, can we come kill you? No. i put you over here then. You play at your friend's house Fortnite? Or... What game do you play? Fortnite? That'd be an amazing shirt, the salty YouTuber. Uh, uh, am I the only AI guy? Because these guys were talking about another AI guy just earlier. Yeah, suck it, dude. Heck out of here. Uh, then we want to come grab the silk. And you are going to stay here. What about Star Citizen? Dude, I want Star Citizen. I just don't want to pay the money. <laughs> I play it every time it comes out in the free flight weekend, at least when I notice. I love, like, it's cool, but, like, I don't know. It's just so long in between updates. That's where I just, like, probably not. I just don't want to buy a ship that's going to, you know, be free when the game comes out. I think I'm going to keep sending everyone over to Madrid because I'm just trying to make as much money as possible. Uh, speaking of that, we can actually buy another trader, I think. No, 215. Brian being sheep. Hey, I don't make money right now. That's why <laughs> That's why I'm trying to like get to Twitch, you know, uh, uh, viewership and stuff like that so I can make some money so I can actually get more games. So you denounce me. Cool, cool, cool. And the funny thing is, I'm talking about buying uh, 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 No Man's Sky, which um, we can no more have ex which is like 50 bucks right now on PC. So kind of annoying actually, because the game's been out so long. But I, I can't hate on them too much since they are doing so many updates, dude. I really need to get some food over here, please. We could also conquer Leon here pretty quickly. I think what we need to do is. You know what? Screw you. I'm gonna condemn your heretic. I'm gonna heal you up. If we can take out Callus, we'll be in a much better spot. So he did end up shooting you. I'm gonna level you. Let's move you here. And then level. And then you're gonna come here. And where the freaking heck is my battering ram, please? Ugh, next turn. And then we can actually do damage on this freaking city. And hopefully knock out these walls. You got really hurt. Dang. Run away. Run away. Uh, he's rolling out with knights right now, which is scary. I'm gonna fortify up here. You're gonna come into the water. How are we gonna take on this knight? That's gonna be a little scary, so. Drew, uh, used to only do AI. I know, I watched, I was looking at some of this stuff recently. He's only doing, uh, uh, the Heart's Iron now, so. Oh yeah, there you go. You said it. 
Brian will game for food. Yes, please. I will game it for food. Dallas Destiny reference. I actually never played Destiny. When you don't, uh, just use mods. Yeah. Yeah, Kali, Kala, 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 Kala. Sorry. Market. Let's make money. And then... I'm gonna grab some more tea. We can sell that off. I'm actually starting to lose confidence in our war against France. I'm just throwing that out there. Kala? Kali? Oh, yeah, I'm terrible at pronouncing. You should know this about me. You heal. Kala. That's what I'm saying. Kala. Kale. Kale. Gotcha. A. <laughs> but you can't put the. Whatever. It's also a, uh, by the way, in, you know, most pronounced. Like, if you put that in front of a sentence, it's pronounced a. Uh, so. Can't hate on me that much for that. Crap the world is multiplayer? Hmm. I never followed Crap the World that much. Dang freaking night, dude. I'm immediately regretting our war here. I am really regretting this war right about now. Cool. She still has less military strength than me, but she is kicking my butt. She has better units than me, which is kind of the issue. Question is, can I bring the walls down on this city? And it doesn't look like it. Yeah. So I think we're gonna have to switch up to a defensive game plan. So I need to get all of my units into a defensive formation. I'm gonna put you over here. You're gonna stay in the water, but you're gonna move over here so you can't get shot. You're gonna move into the water so you don't get whacked by 10 people. You're probably gonna die. I'm gonna move you back here for protection. Problem is, we're still going to lose you in three turns. You need more uh, varied troops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm playing as America right now. You should do a free time at the end of your stream like Potato. I don't know what that is. What's the free time? I've never actually watched any of his streams. You have to at least settle North Carolina and South Carolina before the end. I don't think that's going to happen. Mostly because France is there. So I can't really settle an area that France is already located in. Also, we're at two hours, so I probably should wrap this up pretty quick. I got to do some crap before my wife gets home tonight. Um, this is Fort Hope, which is losing. Did we build a monument? We did. Let's get a granary going. Play random games at the end. He draws and talks to you at the end. Oh, all right. Uh, peace out and settler spam. Yeah, you know, we never actually really did our settler spam, did we? You guys distracted me. I don't think I can piece them out. Has it been 10 turns? No, we still got four more turns. <laughs> That's racist, Bridget. Well, okay. We could play random games. What random games could we play? The problem is anytime I play random games, you guys are all going to leave. That's the thing. So if I start playing a random game, like half of you guys are all going to disappear and I'm going to be, you know, all alone talking to myself. So, uh, I am going to grab the stone and you got a lumber mill over here. So let's actually send you down here because I think we have more than enough stuff down here and let's start working you on Montreal. So, oh yeah, yeah, now nah, we're in a bad situation. I would agree. This is definitely not going as well for us. I wonder if we started again and did the faith thing, how different it would be. So. Uh, we're going to send you back south. And that's actually what I wanted to see. I wanted to come hit his galley. So. I don't mind Paradox's DLC policy. Usually. It's a problem when, you know, you literally buy all their games for two years and fall six DLCs and $120 worth behind. <laughs> That's a bit of a problem. I'm just saying you guys just like leave because well, some people are just here for uh, for Civ. And so when I stop playing Civ, then people are like, nah, we're gonna go find something else to do. We're gonna go watch this other Civ YouTuber. Man, we found a really bad time on this. So we basically got this war right as 
France upped all their units, which sucks. Let's get you all the way back here. And then let's do some shooting. Minor victory, major victory, major victory. If I attack him, I think we're still fine to attack him. He doesn't really have any knights close to me. We can take a shot here, but I think I'd rather kill you. And shooting the, that doesn't really help me. Um, this horseman's probably gonna die, unless I switch. I could keep doing this, just switch back and forth. Fortunately, we can't really do anything with you. I can't really hit him. So what if we took you, put you up here, let's get you here, and then shoot. And I guess you're just gonna shoot there for now. And then we're gonna come up here. And that's about all I can do with you. Come bring you over here. You guys are nice HP now. Get you up there so you can heal. Get you up here so you can heal. We got a great person? What? Great Admiral. How do we get a great Admiral? Oh my god. Okay, we can watch you get wrecked for the next time. Or wait for the next time. I mean, here's the thing. I don't know if we can pull this one out. I mean, I'm feeling a little more confident right now, but we'll see.